Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's our favorite video today. I'm doing a Costco haul. I have a big list to get, but I'm also gonna be showing you guys some new products, like what they have new at Costco. I'm gonna be trying a little bit of a different format today. So let me know down in the comments how you like it. I'm gonna try and go through things a little bit quicker so you can see more products. Let's just jump right in. I know a lot of you guys like these protein drinks. So right when we walked in, I saw that they were actually on sale for $20. They're usually $27 and you get an 18 pack. They're 11 fluid ounces a piece. I have tried these before and we like the chocolate, but they are not allergy friendly. I know a lot of you guys take collagen. Um, I have tried this brand before and really like it. I love that you can get such a large jar of it here at Costco. So $6 off right now, it's $24 for 24 ounces. It's a huge jar, it'll last you forever. A lot of people like to put this into their coffee and like whisk it in. And then right next door, we also have this liquid IV right here. It's in the kind strawberry, at least that's the only kind I'm seeing here. And you get a 30 stick pack for $23. Basically, this is supposed to be as hydrating as three water bottles. So I've heard good and bad things about this if you've tried it and you like it will you let us know in the comments down below that would be super helpful a traeger is definitely on my list of things to have whenever we have a backyard so the traeger you can see up there it is on sale for 700 dollars. and then they also have this outdoor cooking pit this is the outdoor cooking pit it actually looks really nice i love that they've got like a little bit of rose gold going around it and it's matte black it is 129 for this big guy it's pretty big so just keep that in mind you have to have the space for it protein is always a struggle for me to get enough of it in and they have these protein 2o plus electrolyte drinks here you get six strawberry watermelon and six orange mango those kinds actually sound really good to me so it says no artificial sweetener color or flavors which is awesome you get a 12 pack and it's on sale right now for 15 dollars regularly 19. They have these honey roasted pistachios right here. They have no shells on them. You don't even have to peel them. And it is a 22 ounce bag. They're honey roasted for $15. I shared this before and I got mixed reviews in the comments on whether you guys like it or not, but this is the guilt-free Jojo's chocolate. I'm sure you guys have seen a bunch of influencers talking about it as well, but they have it here at Costco, 16.8 ounces for $9.99. And I believe this is just the original kind. Yes, so it's dark chocolate, pistachios, almonds, and cranberries. Right next door to the JoJo's are these coconut almonds with dark chocolate. These are not allergy friendly, but let me tell you, if you like any kind of chocolate covered nuts, you will love these. You have to like coconut as well, but they are so, so, so good. We have eaten them before and it's really hard to not eat an entire bag very quickly. Um, it contains tree nuts, milk, and soy. So just so you know that, and then it's $12.89 for 32 ounces. They also have these Brookside. They basically are like the covered dark chocolate fruits, passion fruit and strawberry right here. And then a acai and blueberry. The acai and blueberry are going away, but they're both 32 ounces for 10.69. Again, not allergy friendly, but a great little treat. As for the first thing that I am grabbing today, I'm gonna grab these Stretch Island Fruit Leathers for Logan. Last time we got these pure organic fruit layered bars and he did like them a lot. Those guys are 11.99 and you get 28 of them. We're still kind of working through them, but we're on the last tail end. So I need some more snacks. And we're gonna try these guys today. They're not organic, but they do have pretty good ingredients. The only thing I see is uh, natural flavors, which I don't love, but we just need some quick snacks sometimes that are already pre-packaged. So you get 50 of these guys for 1050. If you like kind bars, they do have them here. It's a 20 bar variety pack. You get salted caramel, dark chocolate almond. That is a mouthful. And dark chocolate almond and sea salt, both 10 of each kind. They actually sound really good to me. Gluten-free, obviously if you're allergic to nuts, maybe don't get these. And I'm not sure if they contain milk or not, but you are getting 20 of them for $18.89. It says it just contains almonds, cashews, pecans, and soy for allergens, so no milk. So these are pretty allergy friendly. These are definitely not the best of ingredients, but I have to be completely honest with you. I've tried these before years and years back, so I'm not sure if the formula has changed, but they are really, really good. These are the sweet and salty peanut bars and they are by Nature Valley, but they are not as crumbly as like those crunchy ones down there that we all know in the green packaging. But these guys are, you get 48 of them for $12.79. We have some really cute succulents here. You get three of these guys for $20. And I love the pots that they come in already potted. They're just really cute. It looks like a few people have mixed and matched what they wanted. But honestly, I love the texture on these guys. They look really well made. And sometimes I feel like when you're looking for succulents or potted plants, they only come in this like inside pot and then you have to figure out what pot you want. So if you want something easy, maybe some great gifts, this one's a great one. Along the same lines of plants, these ones are really fun too. They're called tulip bulbs in vase. They're $12.99, long life tulips it says. So you keep them indoor at room temperature and natural light. 
but how fun. So basically it goes like this, it's a tulip life cycle. So no buds, enjoy, enjoy your blooms in two to three weeks from where they're at right now. You'll have them like start to bud on the top and then a week from then you'll have full blooms. I feel like that's a really cool idea. And of course, whenever they're dead, you can always keep this vase, which is a pretty nice vase. So if you have ever been wanting to try out a Dyson, this one is the cordless one. It's the V8 Animal Plus. It's a cord-free stick vacuum and right now it's $80 off. It's th basically $300. It's usually $380. They are now on to like V11. So this is definitely a couple of generations back, but I have still heard great things about these guys. We personally own a shark, so I can't speak to them, but I know they're very popular. Also right next door, we have this iRobot Roomba and this guy is being sold for $700. If you are working from home or your kiddos are back in school and you need some Sharpies and Expo markers, they are actually on sale right now. So you get the Sharpies are 25 count for $9.49 and then the Expo markers are 18 count for $10. Don't forget about your teachers, you guys. They are still working really, really hard and this would be a great gift to drop off in their classroom for 10 bucks. They're teaching your kiddos. They're doing such an amazing job at it. So this would be a great little surprise to leave them with on like a special morning. I get asked all the time, what blender I use and I just came across they have like this whole blender set up right here but this Nutribullet blender combo is actually on sale right now for $80 it's typically $100 we have had a Nutribullet before nothing this fancy just like the really basic one that just came with this and the Nutribullet and it still works amazing. So I love the Nutribullet, especially if you are needing something in just like a small quantity. It's not like a full size blender. But if I were to really like go back and do it again, I would get a Vitamix. We have the Ninja, but I really, I just feel like it doesn't do as good of a job as it could. The Vitamix that they have here is the E320 and it is on sale for $400. And it looks like this is everything that you get with it right here. Make sure you check your local Costco. We are all stocked up on toilet paper here, tons and tons of it as you can see, but they are limiting you to one. If you are using Charmin or Northern Lights, I believe this is actually like a dupe for Northern Lights. We've only ever used the Kirkland stuff and I got my mother-in-law to try the Kirkland stuff one time and she said she'll never go back. So it's a lot cheaper to buy the Kirkland brand and it's just as good. As far as paper towels go, we are really running low, at least at my local Costco, but they are limiting you to one and the only kind that they have available Available right now is the bounty we did try it it was great $20.99 but it's a lot more expensive than the Kirkland brand and the Kirkland brand is just as good they have a little Asian inspired end cap right here so let me show you what they've got they have this Monterey Gourmet Foods teriyaki stir-fry udon noodles it says it's microwavable and ready in minutes and it comes with four servings of it and right now it's on sale for $5.69 it's regularly $7.99 $2.30 off. They also have these healthy noodles right here. Very interesting. Keep refrigerated. Okay, so they're gluten-free, fat-free, sugar-free, cholesterol-free, and dairy-free. So they're soybeans. So if you are trying to stay away from soy, stay away from these guys. They're on sale right now, $4 off. $10 is what you're getting them for. And it looks like you get six packets of them in there. They're pretty heavy duty too. So I'm wondering how far they would stretch. Up here, they've got some organic Kung Pao chicken. That looks so good to me. $6.79 for that guy, but you're paying per pound. So it's $6.79 per pound. And then right here, we have some Chinese style barbecue pork ribs, $8.89 per pound. You guys know that I shot for two weeks. Well, right now we still have a little bit of our cantina salsa left, enough to pair, but probably last us about a week. This guy is really great. It's $6.49 for 48 ounces and it tastes super fresh. It says it's a medium heat. I would say it's more mild, but I'm actually gonna switch it up and go with the organic salsa. It's the um, mango and peach one. This is a more like fruity, sweeter salsa. I've tried it before. It's really, really great. Great ingredients as well. You can hardly see those. Sorry, they're so tiny. $6.49 for that guy as well. Also 48 ounces. If you're not looking out for any allergens and you need a quick meal for your family, do not sleep on these flautas. They are so good. I don't know why they're so good, but you can pop them in your air fryer or your oven. They're really easy. And I've even frozen them before. So you can cut these, like it comes in a two pack. You can cut them in half and throw one in your freezer. $10 for those guys. If you guys have never tried the brand Adels, it's so good. I hope I'm saying that right. But right now they have the um, pineapple bacon chicken sausage for $13.99, you get three pounds of it. Then they also have the organic chicken apple sausage, two and a half pounds for $15.49. I'm gonna pick up one of these guys because I think it would be really easy for lunches. 
the ingredients are pretty minimal considering they're like a sausage. The taste on them is incredible. It's serve them over rice or with potatoes or some kind of French fries and you can freeze them as well. They come in like individual packets. While I feel like these guys are pretty allergy friendly, this is also by the same brand. They're the chicken meatballs, they're teriyaki and pineapple. They are not as allergy friendly, but they are so good. So if you want to try the meatballs, definitely go for them, $13.79. If you are someone who doesn't love sweet in your sausages, I've tried these before as well, and they're actually great. These are the organic basil and cracked black pepper smoked chicken sausage by Sabatino's, 2.25 pounds for $13.79. These are the ingredients on them right there. Pretty allergy friendly to me. Right below those guys, I wanna show you these chicken burrito bowls. I know a lot of you guys are on the go and sometimes you don't always have the amount of time that I have to prepare things and I totally get that. These are the ingredients on these guys. So obviously you've got some cheese going in there and milk and things like that. But other than that, they're gluten-free and they're high in protein and high in fiber, which is awesome. Comes with seasoned chicken breast, a blend of brown and white rice, black beans, corn, so not corn-free, roasted salsa and topped with cheese and I'm pretty sure you just microwave these. That would be a really quick and easy lunch or breakfast on work days. I've shared these before with you guys. These are the chicken street tacos that Costco prepares like on their own for you. But honestly, I've heard amazing things. We cannot try them because they contain wheat, milk, and soy, and I'm pretty sure those are corn tortillas. But you guys, if you've never tried them, you don't have allergies, pick one up. It's a super easy dinner pretty dang healthy for you too and I love just the way it's set up like how easy just throw that out good to go I talked to you guys last time about the budget that we are trying to keep I'm going to go over budget today but it's okay because I'm going over budget on meat I know for a fact there is no way that we can eat all of this meat in two weeks and so a lot of it's going to go into the freezer it's just so much more cost efficient for me to buy it here at Costco, price per pound, it just makes more sense. And then I will cut it into like different sections and we will freeze it. So let me show you what I've got. I picked up a big pork shoulder butt. It's boneless, $21.87 for that guy. It's $1.79 a pound. Like this guy is huge. And I wanna make carnitas with it. I love the carnitas that they sell here. That's by the brand Del Real. But obviously I can make probably two or three batches of carnitas in the crock pot with this guy. The carnitas that are sold by Del Real are $15 for I think two pounds. And this is 12.22 pounds for $20. So obviously a much better deal there. Carnitas are really easy to make in the slow cooker. I'll show you guys over on my Instagram if you guys ever wanna see that recipe. I also picked up this stew meat right here already pre-cut if you can see that in there. We've had their stew meat before, it's awesome. I can usually get three meals out of this stew meat. 26, 68, it is 5.49 a pound, super easy. And then I will just divide it into three Ziploc baggies and throw it into the freezer. Also got our regular like organic chicken breasts right here, $25 for three packs. They're already individually packed and I just throw whatever we don't use in the freezer. We are getting some organic turkey right here. I, I believe it's around $17 for three pounds, which is great. I am also getting these sirloins right here. This one came with eight in a pack, $32.81, $8.99 a pound, which is pretty good. And we're gonna use that for like steak fajitas and things like that. But we will probably only use two of the eight of them for the three of us. So that'll make four different meals. Picking up a pineapple, it doesn't seem like any of them are crazy ripe, but I just let them ripen on my counter for a couple of days and they seem to do fine. $2.99 each. I typically buy grapes that are only organic, but on this week we really need some right now and I can't go to another store today. So I'm gonna grab this guy. It is four pounds of green grapes for $10.99, which seems a little bit pricey to me, but it's a great snack. I'm gonna grab four things of bananas. You get three pounds for $1.59. And honestly, I just need some to go spotty so that we can throw them into the freezer. I showed you guys how I did that over on my Instagram and in my last day in the life video of how I like flash freeze them and all of that for our smoothies. Organic spinach is on my list for this week. I love using spinach to beef up any of our meals and letting it just wilt down. So $3.99 for a pound of organic spinach, which usually does last us at least a week, if not two. I always need to get a thing of mushrooms for Derek. So I always get these organic Baby Bella mushrooms, 24 ounces for $5. And then I will just cut them up myself and keep them in a Ziploc bag in the fridge. And they seem to do pretty well for us. <laughs> I almost thought they were out of celery. I've never seen them completely out of celery, but these are the only two boxes left. So anyways, I'm gonna grab one of these guys. Yeah, this one looks fine. And we will use this to beef up like our soups and stews and things of that sort. Derek really wants some beef stew this week. And then I also love to eat these with some peanut butter or even just ranch for a quick snack. 
$5.49 for two and a half pounds of organic celery sticks. I love these broccoli florets that are already ready to go. I typically buy things that aren't already ready to go because it saves money, but this is the only option they have here for broccoli. You get three pounds of it for $5.99. We love roasting these guys up to have in like bowls and stuff like that, but also you can put them into soups, pastas, anything like that to get some good broccoli in. I typically don't really buy it lettuce like this. I typically buy it, buy it already done, but $4.79 for six pounds of organic romaine hearts. I feel like you can't really beat that price. So I'm gonna pick up one of these guys. We're eating a lot of taco bowls and things like that where lettuce would be a great way to beef it up just a little bit and give it some crunch. So one of these guys is going in the cart and coming home with me today. I just picked up five and a half pounds of the organic pink lady apples right here. They actually have done really well in terms of like crispness for us. So they are, let's see, $6 less than the honey crisp apples right there, which to me is a great savings, especially if they taste just as good. We are going to be making a ton of stuff with bell peppers this week. And Logan has been loving to munch on bell peppers, like for a snack, which I am all about. So I'm gonna grab two bags of these bell peppers. It comes with six in each bag, so that'll be 12. And they are $6.99 for a six count bag, which is great because typically they're around $8.99. Just pick the ones that look the best. We are in need of some oranges and typically I go for this 14 pound box. Actually, I guess it's now 13 pounds for $13.99, which you can see up there under navels, but they have the Cara Cara oranges back. I'm so excited because they are so good. Hopefully these guys are in season and ready to go but eight pounds for $8.99. We're using these in a couple of recipes this week, along with like some carnitas chicken that I'm cooking up that calls for some fresh orange juice, but Logan loves, loves, loves to eat oranges. I do not drink coffee, so I'm not really sure if these are new or not, but I can tell you I've never seen them here before. These are the nut pods. They're the almond and coconut creamers. It looks like you get a pack of three for $10. I'm not sure if that's a good deal or not. I'm assuming it's a pretty good deal. So if you use nut pods, those guys are here. And then of course, right below, they always have this Coffee Mate French vanilla. You get two of the 56 ounces for $8. We just ran out of our berry mixture and I've been loving to use it in smoothies and my oatmeal and things like that. Uh, by the way, hi, you can see me in the reflection. So this organic five pound berry mixture for just under $12 comes with strawberries, blackberries, blueberries, and raspberries. Grabbing some of these guys, they did have some cheese sticks here like two weeks ago. As you guys know, we've started Logan on cheese and he loves cheese. $12.89 for 52 of them. So we'll give it a shot. And if he doesn't like them, we'll bring it on back because Costco has a great return policy. I randomly ran out of cocoa powder. This is cacao powder. This is actually better for you than cocoa powder, but it's unsweetened. It's here, but only until it's gone because that's what that asterisk means. $10 for 32 ounces. I feel like that's honestly a pretty good deal and it's organic. We need some oil. I typically grab avocado oil, but I've been needing to brown some things and avocado oil doesn't really do well with browning. So I'm going to grab this organic extra virgin olive oil, two liters for $10 because this is so big and won't fit into our spice cabinet. I'm just going to use like an oil, what do you call that? Like dispenser or sprayer or something like that so that I, I can keep like a small one out by the stove. You guys remember when I bought four things of this Rayo's Rouse, however you say it, marinara sauce? We're already out. $10.99, you get two of them, 28 ounces. I think I'm going to go for one, maybe two. Let me look at my meal plan. I'm so silly. Why would I even consider just getting one? These are so easy to have in your food store. So I'm going to grab two of these guys because pasta is always a quick meal. And I like to always have stuff on hand for that. Derek needs his regular salsa. This is the one he likes. It's the medium Kirkland organic salsa. Shelf stable, $7.79 for two of them. He says it's really good. So I am technically not out of black beans, but I'm going to be needing them because we have so many meals this week with black beans going into them. So you get eight of these cans for $6.99. It's honestly a great deal for organic beans, especially if you don't want to have to cook them yourself. These guys are coming home with me and straight into the food store. We ended up trying these fruit and vegetable pouches. They're the Kirkland brand. You get 24 of them for $10.99 and they're organic, which is great for Logan. They're little like applesauce pouches and he loved them. So I'm going to grab him a box of these and right on down here. I'm actually also going to grab him these organic applesauces as well. We go through like two of these boxes, honestly, pretty quickly, but they're good snacks for him and he loves doing it himself. Organic applesauce pouches, $8.49 for 24 of them. This one's just a little bit cheaper, I think, because it doesn't have the veggies in it. I have to share this because I've never seen them have these packs of chips before. You get 10 of each. You get the Flavor Blasted Goldfish. The These are the corn ones by late July. They do have corn-free ones that have like the same packaging. They look almost identical, but they're really good tortilla chips. And then Backyard Barbecue Kettle Brand Chips, which are Derek's favorite kind of barbecue chips. 
You get 30 of them for $12. You guys, I'm so excited. I just happened to walk by the rice and I was looking for some organic brown rice. Last time that I was here and they didn't have any. 12 pounds for $12. I actually think I might buy two and then keep them in our food storage because it's ended up being a lot cheaper to cook rice this way rather than getting them at Trader Joe's. And I've just been cooking it in the Instant Pot and it's been awesome. I can't remember if I've ever shared these with you guys either, but they have these popcorners here. They're you get 28 of these bags. You get nine sea salt, nine white cheddar, and 10 sweet and salty kettle corn ones. So if you're into that, they do contain corn, sunflower oil, and sea salt. And I think some of them do contain milk. So just be aware of that, but they are on sale. $6.99 for 28 of them, regularly $10. Diapers are always a need for us. We are finally out of our big stockpile of diapers. I love the Kirkland brand ones. They are the exact same as the Huggies Little Movers. These are actually the ones that we used to use. I love that they have the double grip on them. $35.99 for 180 of them. You honestly cannot beat this price. Final cart time before I try to put this massive box of diapers in there and then you really can't see anything. On the bottom here, we've got two bags, 12 pounds each of the organic short grain brown rice. We have some organic black beans, some cara cara oranges right back there. We also have some organic chicken breasts and we have two things of applesauce package packets or pouches. I guess I was trying to say a mixture of both. This one is the fruit and veggie. This one's just the regular applesauce. We also have some stew meat. We've got some pork shoulder. We have this Tillamook medium cheddar snack portions. We have two things of the Rouse marinara sauce. Right below the Rouse, we've got some green grapes. And then we have some pink lady apples right down here. Here's the other Rouse sauce and then the salsa that Derek really likes. We also have this bag of frozen berry mixture right here. And then below that, we have four things of bananas and two things of a six count of bell peppers. We have some organic cacao powder, some sirloin steaks down here. We've got eight of them. We have some broccoli florets along with some celery sticks right here, olive oil, and a big old pineapple. We have some mango and peach salsa right down here, some organic baby spinach, some organic romaine. We have some organic ground turkey, organic brown mushrooms, and I'm really, really excited for these guys, the Adele's organic chicken and apple sausages. And then right below this sirloin steak right here, we have the Stretch Island fruit leathers. This is gonna be a huge total just because of all the meat, but thankfully meat lasts a while, especially in the freezer. Uh, I'll let you guys know what the total ends up being. Well, you guys, good thing that was a lot of meat and stuff that can be frozen. I mean, going to the food storage, but that was literally just under $400. It was $394. So if you enjoy these kinds of videos, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.